Just a disclaimer, I have no formal knowledge of finances and this is just my personal opinion with data from their website. Also not sponsored. Wish it would be though. I live in Slovenia, which is a part of the European Union, which uses Euro as its main currency. But we really like to travel for holidays in our neighboring countries, for example Croatia, which is also a part of the European Union, but they use Kuna, which makes it a nightmare to exchange. I never know if I should exchange my money before I leave for Croatia or if I should exchange my money there. And how much money should I even exchange? Should I even be traveling with so much cash? And if I use my debit card for withdrawals, the bank charges me 2 euros for a single withdrawal, no matter how much money I withdraw. And when you get back home, you're usually stuck with the foreign currency. This one has been sitting in my drawer for the past year or so. So Nate recently introduced me to Revolut, which is an app that removes all currency exchange fees. Also, you can send, spend or exchange money without any fees at all. So you have an app and you can also get a physical card that works like a top-up MasterCard. So you put your money on the Revolut card via bank transfer or with another card and then you can send it to your fellow Revolut users or you can pay with it in shops or restaurants or even withdraw some money from the ATM, all for free. They even send you a physical contactless MasterCard for free. Revolut uses interbank exchange rates. So you actually get a better deal that you could get anywhere at any bank or exchange office. So you actually save money while traveling. So next time that we go to Croatia or London, we could just top up our Revolut and use it to pay everything. You instantly, and I mean like instantly before the receipt is even printed, get a notification on your phone of how much you spent and where did you spend your money. And you can also add a location safety feature, which prevents your card being charged if the card and your phone are not on, in the same location. Also, no ATM withdrawal fees, which means I just saved two euros or more. But it's not all sunshines and rainbows. There are some fees if you're a big spender. Withdrawing cash from ATM is free for up to 650 euros per month. You can send, transfer and exchange for up to 6,000 euros per month. Top up via bank transfer in single euro payments area is free, but your bank might charge you a fee. Top up in USD is expensive. It can range from one to 4% depending on which type of top up you prefer. It might be cheaper for you to use bank transfer. Also, if you're paying or withdrawing money on weekend days, it might be cheaper for you to use your normal credit card because Revolut uses Friday's closing rate plus 0.5% just to be safe because banks don't work on weekend days. We have also found that Revolut doesn't work with pre-authorizations, for example, for hotel bookings or for automatic petrol stations. I have to stress that this card is mainly meant for international payments, which means it can't completely substitute your normal bank account. Um, for example, you can't receive your salary on the Revolut card because all the bank transfers must be made in your name to prevent money laundering. However, they did just release a Revolut for businesses in beta, so maybe that would be possible soon if your employer would use Revolut also. Also, another thing regarding safety, all your funds are held, are physically held in a pooled client account at Barclays, which means that the bank can't lend out your money, which also ensures a high level of protection. So if you want to see more of our furry faces, be sure to click that subscribe button. And um, that's it for today. Bye!